Uh, thank you for hanging out for what a weird day this was. Such a under the seat there. Okay, reaching for something that feels like there's one. There's another. We're probably just gonna go once at 422, come back, if that's fine that's with fine. you, going on the highway. If you want to drive on the highway, that's fine. Uh, was that a cautionary? <laughs> no, it's fine. I, I drive it on the highway all the time. Okay. You're gonna want that for a speedometer. Okay. Now I need to figure out these seat the seat belts. The seat belt probably fell behind, it always does. Okay. There you go. All right. And when you start it, let the uh, other way. Other way. Turn other, it. other way. Turn it. So there you go. Okay. You gotta tighten that with the, there you go. Nope. <laughs> Takes a little bit of use too. So it doesn't pull. This thing, one has to meet the other. Yes. All right. So no need to have the foot on the brake. But, um, turn it so the uh, it's on on. And then give it a couple seconds. All right, you should be able to just crank it and have it. Okay. Go. I can see what you mean about that fuel pump. And that's just, it just makes that noise. All the time. Okay. All right, we got oil pressure. We're about breaking even. I'm making a little bit more gas. Engine temperature reads 150 degrees. I, this thing's covering up the gear you, position. You can't see it because it doesn't exist. It would be right there. Uh-huh. It's been removed. So just back one is reverse. Okay, that's yep, reverse. Right reverse. Now we're now neutral. neutral. And one more is drive. Drive. Neutral, reverse. Ka-chunk. Yup. All right. It's got that 727 three-speed. Where are my lights if I need them? Um, Actually, I want to run the, I want to run the lights. All oh, this one? Yep. Right. And uh, if you want to turn it on high beam, it just turns on all four, which is not, yep, there you go. I'd leave it on high because it's really not that bright and it makes mm. the car easier to see. You can see it has a little red indicator that says high. Oh, there it is. Yep. Yep. All righty. Reverse. Ooh, you got power steering. Oh, it's super oh. boosted. Just like all those old uh, Mopars, they were all over boosted. Oh. Did Matt like it? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Thanks for letting him do that little oh, chirp yeah, with the tires. Oh, like, like Leno says, one finger. It's all it takes. <laughs> Cruising around, this thing is great. And I love, you know, this is something that, I mean, sure the Falcon has these too, yep. the, the wings. Yep. All right. There's second gear. Yep. Is it three speeds? Yep. No overdrive? No. Uh, and you will pull at about uh, 60, you're pushing 3,000 RPM. Yep. Yeah. A little, a little less than 3,000. Okay. For those of you who are watching this, I'm driving the uh, the Cornet first, and then the Subaru second. So, do you think that Subaru had uh, uh, mufflers on it? Or do you think that might have been straight pipe? Yeah, that was pretty. It was pretty loud. I took a look under that car. That thing might be straight pipe. It might be. This has a nice. It's not yeah. super uh, aggressive exhaust. Honestly, driving it on the highway, if it was any louder, it would probably be annoying. Yeah. Okay, brakes, 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 well, brakes, brakes, brakes. pretty good. If you pump it, they work even better. Oh, okay. Literally, uh, the rear disc we just put on yesterday. <laughs> and it's not nearly as floaty because it has new suspension on the front, too, new shocks. The noise of the fuel pump correlates to the fluctuations in your ammeter. <laughs> or not ammeter, your, your volt meter. Yep. Yeah, you can see it. This thing runs at a lot higher oil pressure than the Falcon does. The Falcon's like at 50 PSI when it's idling. Oh yeah, it'll level out after a little while and go down. Is the choke still on or, or is it an automatic no, it's, choke? It's off. Okay. Well, it idles a lot better than the Falcon. The Falcon the idle wanders a little bit. Oh. Again, still chasing sort of, just trying to get heat out of that engine bay. What are these guys? These guys are all turning. And I'm turning this way. Yield, yielding, yielding to everybody. Yeah. Well, there it is. So 
it isn't going to be the highway merge that I was hoping for because there's a lot of traffic going on. <laughs> but there's nothing stopping me from rubber banding just a tad. Blind spot is a for an older car. Just that the, the styling of the rear, that big A. Well, it's just A and B. Yeah. A and the, B the, yeah. The, the B pillar is pretty large there. This feels kind of like the Falcon did uh, with the with the older rear end. Right. And it also it sounds like the Falcon in here. A lot of wind coming around everything. I have a breeze as well. I can see daylight coming right in here. You're also getting a breeze because there's a hole right in the floor, <laughs> right here. Thanks for driving all the way from Pottstown for this. I like driving this in East Will it kick down or no? Uh, you have to really get out of it. Ah, uh, okay. I mean, it might, at that ratio, if you're going to kick down right now, it's going to be screaming. Oh, okay, day. yeah. Like I said, I've only got 90. 90 was, was pretty good. We need to go left, but we need the rightmost left so we can get maximum left to get back on 422 the other way. Now, if you notice you pump the brake, you'll feel it get harder. Harder. Yep. Yep. Okay. Yeah. You get. You got to drive the Falcon and feel the brakes on that thing. They're they're right Spot on there. On. They're right on. You can lock like them up pretty try, quick. Yeah. The, I mean the the drums that were on this, it it definitely started catching sooner when you yeah. put the brakes on. Yeah. And it felt like you were just pushing against like concrete mm. to stop it yeah but it would it would lock up this feels much more i guess modern even though yeah. it's still no power brakes but it has that more gradual feel to it yeah your turn signal stays on though mine is real oh, touchy it. It, it, it it always wants to cancel yeah, itself right. the guy behind us an older man he looks like he's 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 reading the car looking at it People seem to appreciate it. <laughs> <laughs> I do that a lot with the Falcon. Oh, Just yeah. nothing, nothing, nothing. Brah. Thanks, thanks for bringing it out, even though yeah. it's going to be so cold today. I'm taking it easy, easy, easy around this on ramp. Looking for my area to merge. And merging. I think it, that was second gear still? No, it was third. That was a pull. That was a good pull in third. That's third the whole way. Yeah. Very nice. Now, if it had the original 391 gears in it. 391. You would have, it would have been Whoa. screaming. <laughs> but you would have had so much torque. It yeah. Just, just torque monster. See what I mean? You're about 2,500 RPM right now. It's right. 60. Yeah. Now these things also came in, in like four speeds. Yeah. yeah. But the RT you could get it with the, the standard RT was on the tree. Oh. Shift. Okay. Weird. Uh, the center console was an option. Mm. Here comes a Mustang. Yeah. Oh, you tinted your side windows. Oh, roush. I'm sure you're a nice guy, but I'm still judging. Oh, body lean. Oh, yeah. Oh, body lean. It's, it's a lot better than it was with those drag uh, shocks on Oh, yeah? Way better. I think it's like being on the ocean. <laughs> oh, yeah, because they want them to squat. Well, yeah, yeah. it's, it's uh, fast up, slow down. Nice. Is there a different, like, uh, a higher stall converter in this, do you know? I, mean, I have no idea. I have to no. talk to my uncle about it. He, okay. I mean, I've only had it since September. Right. And uh, I've just been doing stuff to make it more drivable. I have a list of stuff to get done with it. At least I 
these tires are actually oh, you super got, grippy too. Oh, you got left and right indicators oh, yeah. on there. Hoo hoo hoo. <laughs> Oh, that power. See, I can't, I'm still so, thinking I'm, I'm in an old car and I'm getting ready to go. Oh, yeah. Like, oh, oh, oh. It's like so overboosted. I can see how this oh, thing was such a, like the, having, uh, having power steering was such a luxury option. Oh, yeah. And people, people considered it sporty. Yeah. Oh, yeah. A friend of mine has a 68 Charger that's not power steering and mm -hmm. it is like trying to drive a truck to move that thing around. There we go, and there we go. Cool. Uh, push the button in for the lights. So there we go. Not tell you. All right. Thank you very much. Thank you. Absolutely. And thank you for the gloves. Hey, no problem.